Jennifer checking in. Today is Wednesday. It's hump day. And I forgot to vlog yesterday. Well, ended up working from home yesterday because uh, the window people were coming out to look at our leaking window. Um, so I got up yesterday and went to the gym. It was all good. And then I dealt with serious, like serious cravings yesterday. Bad. And I was okay all day. Um, pretty much until I went and picked up my daughter from school. And now I got my partner in crime with me. And I'm like, uh, let's go to... Tim Hortons because uh, it was a two-fold visit because I really wanted some donuts or something sweet carbs I wanted carbs like bad for you carbs not like carrots carbs <laughs> unless it was in the form of like carrot cake then that'd be all good but it was the bad carbs I wanted so Caved. Um, I also wanted to. They haven't even had their grand opening yet. Like they're still in their soft opening phase, and people are just bashing them. Like on our local, you know, Facebook page, and it's just like, really, you guys? <laughs> so they ran out of freaking donuts. Like a certain kind of a donut. Did you call and tell them that you were going to be there at a certain? Time? Did everybody call and tell them? You know, they're still trying to figure that out. And. So I just wanted to, it, it, and my other point, I asked the question to these people on this Facebook page, I'm like, do any of you bother to talk to the manager there when you're in there? I mean, if the employees are being rude to you, like, don't you think maybe you should bring that to the attention of the manager at the time when you're there and be like, yo, dude here shouldn't be in customer service or shouldn't be in a job that deals with customers. <laughs> I've had that conversation before with a manager <laughs> and, um, they may not know. And one person said, oh yeah, they talked to him and the manager said, oh, we're just busy. Well, which is an, was not an okay excuse. Like, you need to fix it, you know? So I wanted to go point that out because I wanted him to survive. I want him to, you know, stay there. And um, So yeah, I had donuts last night. And then I had some sushi. <laughs> That was it. So I don't know. I don't know. But then today, Tom again. I had stopped. Tom left. Remember, I've been having them issues. Tom left a couple. I don't know, like a week ago. Now he's back again. Seriously. And I watched. Tina's vlog about the marina and it's like, ah, I was thinking about getting that. So, I don't know what to do. No idea. I do think I am going to, as much as I really don't feel like dealing with this right now, I think I'm going to stop the fill and, and uh, see what happens for a cycle. So that might have been the reason for the really, 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 really bad carb cravings was Tom. So, yeah, that was pretty much it. So I got, I've been getting my steps. I didn't go to the gym this morning. Um, I just didn't. No real rhyme or reason why. And then just didn't feel like it, I guess. <laughs> so, uh, but I have been getting my steps in. I got my, you know, pretty much, I my Sunday was my chillax day. But other than that, I've been getting them in. And it's been all good. So, oh, oof, that's bright. <laughs> I, um, oh, great, it's a freaking 
parking lot again on the freeway, you guys. You guys. All right, well, that's my update for today. I do have a funny story to share with you, more so with Donna, whose birthday it was yesterday. Happy birthday, Donna. Um, so my boss, my former boss, I should say, went and did a marathon over the weekend. He did a half marathon over the weekend. And uh, he was so funny. He said at the lineup, um, there was this guy on crutches there and was like, dang, good for him, you know, like dude like lost his leg and he's here doing a half marathon and whatnot and it was funny. He said about three miles into the marathon. You hear those like clicking noises, click, 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 click. <laughs> and it was like a dude with one leg catching up to him. <laughs> oh, and he said, you know, it was very motivating that you know the people like who have one leg are actually out like running a marathon, you know, or a half marathon or whatever. He said, but it was pretty demotivating for me when they're going to pass me. <laughs> I said, oh yeah, I, I, I get that. Totes. Totally get that. Hey, that's where I'm moving in. Sure am. I totally get that. He said, and then you had the, the hunchback senior citizen running, running past and he's like, yeah, it's just ridiculous. <laughs> so... Anyway, I shared with them with my 5K story that, and I shared with them about you, Donna, doing this marathon with your husband and said, if you guys are the last two places, he better let you finish first. <laughs> I'd be like elbowing my way in there, like, nope, nope. I mean, to the point of probably pushing him down to the ground and <laughs> running. <laughs> Although, like, then you're going to finish, like, second to last. And that's, like, not as cool as, like, last place, right? Like, bragging rights? I don't know. So, anyway, I hope everybody has a great Wednesday. Um, I hope I get all of this figured out with my cravings. Hopefully they're under control. I don't feel as bad. I mean, yesterday, seriously... I had a one track mind. I had to like fight myself to not like leave and go get bad stuff for lunch. <laughs> bad. So anyway, everybody have a great day. I will check in tomorrow. Bye guys.